my loves. So, you received this book from me as a gift after our graduation, and I want to read it now for you, and I hope you enjoy it. It's called The Night Before First Grade. It says, Natasha Wings, The Night Before First Grade. Art by Deborah Zemke. "'Twas the night before first grade I kissed my dog Clover. School's starting tomorrow because summer is over." Into my backpack went my markers and pens. I hung my new outfit. It matched my friend Jen's. I spoke not a word, but went straight to the shelf and filled up my lunchbox. I made lunch myself. I can't wait to see Jenny, I told my big brother. I hope that our desks are right next to each other. That night I was nestled all snug in my bed while visions of jungle gyms danced in my head. The next day at breakfast, Dad made such a fuss. What a big girl you are to be taking the bus. Hurry, Penny, said Mom, as it turned down our street. Over here, shouted Jenny. I saved you a seat. At school, kindergartners stood outside in the hall. They all looked so young. Were they? Were we ever that small? While they clung to their parents, we hugged Miss Sunrise. You two grew so tall, she said with surprise. Ding! rang the school bell. We made such a clatter. We raced to our classroom. Then Jen said, What's the matter? The principal told us that some changes were made. We have split some new students. So we have some no new students. So we split the first grade. We waved goodbye, sadly, and said, see you later. I had to be brave because I'm a first grader. Soon we sat in a circle and we each said our name. Then we played 20 questions and I won the game. Mr. Barr is so funny, he tells jokes and he juggles. And our class pet's so cute, it's a bunny named Snuggles. I knew most of the kids except just a few, so I went and said hi to a girl who was new. We sat side by side and made pictures with noodles. We laughed when we saw we both made noodle poodles. We both have pet turtles and love turquoise blue and pistachio ice cream is her favorite too. I can't wait till you meet my best friend at lunch. I just know that you'll both like each other a bunch. The lunchroom was buzzing so busy and loud. We sat down at a table. Was Jen in this crowd?
when what to my wondering eyes there in line was Jen with a new friend who looked just like mine. I'm Tina. I'm Nina. Their eyes, how they twinkled behind matching frames. They had curly pigtails and they had rhyming names. Our new friends were twins, and though school's just begun, I know first grade will be twice as much fun. I hope you like that story. I thought it was really fun. And I just want you to know, when first, when it's time for first grade, school starts and you, it's time to go, you're ready. You're going to have a great time no matter what changes there are. There's lots of first grade classrooms. Whoever you're with, you're going to make friends and you're going to have a great time. And remember to always be positive, right? Think about everything positively and it's going to go wonderfully, okay? I'm so proud of you. You're ready for first grade. Let's do this. Bye.